Right, guys, so now we're gonna do a uh, the section C. It's the trailer from the front of the trailer all the way to the back of the trailer. Section C. So I'm gonna start with the bulkhead or the face of the trailer. There's not cracks, bent or broken, and I see no holes. My clearance lights. All my clearance lights are not cracked, bent, or cracked, broken or bent. It's securely mounted. Not missing any hardware and they properly work. This frame of the trailer, the frame of the trailer, there's not cracked, broken, or any damage on it. My DOT tape, all of my DOT tape from the front of the truck all the way to the back of the truck, it's properly spaced, and none are missing, they're damaged. My landing gear, all my landing gear on my trailer, landing gear frame is not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted to the trailer, not missing any hardware. The cross member and the support, cross member and the support arms on that crack, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, not missing any hardware. My landing gear crank handle, it's not cracked, broken, or damaged, it's in the lock position. It's not missing any hardware. Securely mounted. My landing gear feet. My landing gear feet. It's clean and free of debris and it's in the fully raised position. All my cross members underneath my trailer. They're not cracked, bent, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the trailer. Not missing any hardware. The floor. The floor. There's no, it's not cracked broken or damaged and I see no holes and it's securely mounted to the vehicle then we're gonna come back here in the back of the trailer we're gonna go in the bottom of the trailer and we're gonna start off at the torsion bar the torsion bar is not cracked broken or damaged securely mounted to the vehicle not missing any hardware the bush in between it's not, there's no abrasions, bulges, or cuts. It's not excessively worn or torn and securely mounted. My brake chamber. I have a dual brake chamber back here because you have two clamps. My brake chamber is not cracked, broken, or damaged. I hear no leaks, securely mounted to the vehicle. Not missing any hardware. All my clamps, all my clamps are securely fastened. They're not cracked, broken, or damaged. Not missing any hardware. All my hoses back here. There's no abrasions, bulges, or cuts, and I hear no leaks. My spring brake, my spring mounts. They're not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle. My leaf springs, my leaf springs are not cracked, broken, or damaged. None are shifted or missing, securely mounted to the vehicle. I have two U-bolts back here. They're not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted to the vehicle, not missing any hardware. They're, they have four spacers, two uh, four spacers and four nuts, and they're in the lock position. They're not cracked, broken, or damaged, not missing any hardware. My push rod, uh, you gotta see, it's hard to see back here, but let me see. Here it is, the push rod right back here behind the brake chamber. It's not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely fastened to the vehicle, not missing any hardware. It's in the lock, it's in the lock position, but from to a pin and a, and a locking pin, if released by hand, it should try and the brakes were released by hand and it should travel no more than one inch of play. My psych adjuster is not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle, not missing any hardware. Brake lining. My brake lining. It's not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted in place. I should have no less than a quarter inch 
My brake line is at its thinnest point. My brake drum is not cracked, broken, or damaged. There should be securely mounted to the vehicle. There should be between the um, the brake lining and the brake drum. There should be no more than. I mean, there should be no contamination like grease or oil or any type of discoloration indicating a heat problem. My inner and my outer hub seal, there's no abrasions, bulges, or any type of cuts. And if there was a leak, I would see a puddle down here. And it's securely mounted, not missing any hardware. My tires, my tires, the inner, excuse me, the outer, the inner, the inner, the outer of the tire and the face of the tires. There's no abrasions, bulges, or cuts, and I hear no leaks. These tires can be recapped, regrooved or retreaded and they can be mismatched um, if I had to add, service these tires I look at the specs on the side of the wall of the tires these tires are at 120 psi if I had to service them I would service them here at the valve stem the valve stems there's two of them there's one here and there's one in here and they're not cracked broken or damaged and they're not leaking the caps, this one's missing a cap, and the other one too, if it had caps, it should be not cracked, broken, or damaged, and they shouldn't be leaking, and they should be in the lock position. All my lug nuts, you gotta touch all the lug nuts on the rim to make sure they're in the lock position. None are missing, they're not cracked or broken or damaged. If they were loose, you would see rust or any shiny marks, shiny threads. My rim, my rim's not cracked, broken, or damaged. I see no illegal holes or illegal welds. My bud rims, my bud rims, there's no uh, any type of debris or any objects between my bud rims and any type of gap between them. They're not cracked, broken, or damaged, and they're securely mounted to the vehicle. My reflectors. My reflectors here are in the rear because they're in the rear they're red they're not cracked broken or damaged securely mounted to the vehicle my clearance light or running light it's not cracked broken or damaged securely mounted to the vehicle and it works now we're at the back of the trailer my clearance lights all the clearance lights back here because they're facing the back they're red they're not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle. And they properly work. My door. My door is not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle. Not missing any hardware. My door cables. They're not cracked. They're not broken or torn. And they're securely mounted to the vehicle. Not missing any hardware. My door latch, my door latch is in the lock position. It's not cracked, bent, or broken. Securely mounted to the vehicle, not missing any hardware. My pinto hook, my pinto hook right here. It's not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle, not missing any hardware. My chain bar, it's not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted to the vehicle. My glide hand receivers, valves, they're not, they're not cracked, broken, or damaged. Not missing any hardware and I hear no leaks. My DOT dump bumper, it's not cracked, bent, or broken, or damaged. And I see no broken welds, securely mounted to the vehicle. My lights, I have my left turn signal my right turn signal my four ways and my brake lights they're not cracked broken or damaged not missing any hardware securely mounted to the vehicle my license plate light 
It's secure, not cracked, broken, or damaged. Not missing any hardware. Securely mounted to the vehicle. My mud flaps. My mud flaps. They're not. They're not. Uh, they're securely mounted to the vehicle. There's, they're not cut or torn. They're properly spaced between the ground and the tires. And then once you finish up with that, then you tell them you would inspect this side of the trailer just like you would inspect the other side with the exception with mine has a door on it so if you had a door over here you would talk about the door my door is uh is in somewhat okay condition it's a little damaged but it doesn't affect the safe operation of the vehicle it's securely mounted to the vehicle the door hinges here they're not cracked bent or broken securely mounted not missing any hardware my ladder here it's not cracked bent or broken securely mounted to the vehicle see no broken welds all the dot on this side and all the way around the vehicle it's properly spaced and clean and free of debris and it's not damaged and that's class that's section c hey we're going to do our couplings we're going to start out with our airlines there are no abrasions bulges cuts or leaks the securely mounted to the truck, securely mounted to the trailer, securely mounted to the trailer by the glad hand and glad hand receiver. They are not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, no missing hardware, they are not leaking. In between them is a rubber seal. The rubber seal is not excessively worn or torn, it is not leaking. Go to my electrical line. My electrical line, there's no cut, frayed, or exposed wire, securely mounted to the junction box on my trailer, junction box on my tractor. If the examiner likes to know, this is my service line, this is my emergency line. My lines and my electric cord have proper distance to the frame of my vehicle or the catwalk. Either or will work. Moving on. This is my actuator line, or we can just call it an air line. Mm -hmm. This is my air lines. No abrasions, bulges, cuts, or leaks. Securely mounted. No missing hardware. It goes to my air ram. My air ram is not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted. No missing hardware. My air ram is in the lock position with these two pins through my platform. Coming back over here, my apron. The apron to my trailer is not cracked, broken, or damaged. It's welded, so there's no illegal or missed welds. Coming in here, my skid plate. My skid plate is not cracked, broken, or damaged. Securely mounted by two pins and a cotter pin. In between my skid plate and my apron, there's no daylight and it's properly greased. This is my lock and jaw lever. It is not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, no missing hardware, and is in the lock position. This right here, this here, and this here is my platform. My platform is not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, no missing hardware. It's welded up here, and all these bolts right here hold it on. They are not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, no missing hardware. My platform is securely mounted to my frame. Why all these bolts right here, they are not cracked, broken, or damaged. Security mounted, no missing hardware. Coming back to the inside of the vehicle. <clears throat> I'm going to point up into the middle of my skid plate. That's my kingpin. My kingpin is not cracked, broken, or damaged. It's welded, so there's no illegal or missed welds. Coming back out, my locking jaw, the bar going across. It is not cracked, broken, or damaged, securely mounted, no missing hardware, and is in the Loctite position around the shank of my kingpin. Coming on out. <coughs> when you come out, I'm gonna take my landing gear shoe. In between my landing gear and my vehicle, I have the proper distance to make a 90 degree turn. That concludes my cuffings.